Hello, this is Rich, and today we're going to be talking about some additional networking devices in more detail. The first device we're going to discuss is a wireless bridge. A bridge is used to connect wired networking devices to your wireless network. You can connect any device that has an Ethernet port to a bridge and thereby connect this device to your wireless network. With certain bridges, you can even connect a switch to the bridge and give yourself multiple Ethernet ports so you can connect an entire wired network to a wireless network. This is very handy to connect certain devices such as gaming adapters, such as an Xbox 360 or a PlayStation or a Wii. You can also use it to connect your DVD player or other devices to your TVs to your network, or share files on your computer with some of these devices. The bridge is not that difficult to set up. In most cases, they will come with a disk that will assist you in setting it up. If you don't want to use a disk and you want to set it up manually, and some of the devices do require that you set them up manually, you will need a computer with an Ethernet port. You will connect the computer to the Ethernet port of the, wireless, of the wireless bridge and use your Internet browser, such as Internet Explorer, to manually configure the device. The device will come with instructions on how to do this. It's very simple to do. You can also get a switch. Now, as I mentioned earlier, a switch will expand can expand the capabilities of certain bridges. Not all bridges will, will support uplinking to a switch. You can also use a switch to expand the capabilities of your network. You can connect this switch to your wired router to give yourself multiple ports. Any wired router you buy nowadays can support many devices. They will be able to support up to 253 devices, so you can expand your network considerably. It's very easy to set up a switch, as switches are plug and play. All you have to do is make the physical connections using an Ethernet cable. There's no other configuration to do with the switch. As you see, you can have multiple devices to expand the capabilities of your wireless network. These are a couple of the additional wireless devices and wired devices you can use to expand the capabilities of your network. In the future, we'll be discussing in more detail the different types of routers you may see and how to use an access point. Thank you for listening.